trip behind the scenes with future country rock blues kings and queens discover them first with palm mash tv palm mash tv It's Paul Mash TV time again. Thank you so much for joining us. We've got another great interview coming up shortly. But before we begin, if you haven't already, click that subscribe button and the bell down there. And anytime a new episode comes your way, you'll be notified. And you can check that out. Leave a comment on the comment section too if you like. And if you're on Facebook, you can go to facebook.com forward slash Paul Mash TV. And uh, you can obviously follow us there and make a comment on the things you see and send us an inbox. And we'd love to hear from you there, and we'd love to hear from you in email as well. It's palmashtv, on one word, at gmail.com. And if you're a band or a solo artist that want to be on the show, go and send us an email, and we'll show you how to do that. And, uh, but also, if you're just simply a fan, uh, we'd love to hear from you, so send us an email, and we'll get back to you. And all this is going to be recapped at the closing credits at the end of the show, so stay tuned for that. In a moment, we're going to have, from Cleveland, Ohio, The Outsiders. Uh, a very awesome band, and I think you're really going to enjoy what they have to say and then the video afterwards. So uh, we're going to start that right now. Okay, here we are with interview time as promised. And with us from Cleveland, Ohio, we have the Outsiders with us today. Thanks for joining us, guys. Hi, everybody. How are you? Hello. Uh, why don't we start by uh, telling everybody who you are? Well, go ahead. <laughs> Rick Storm. I play... Uh keyboards, harmonica, guitar, flute, and I sing a little bit. A little bit. Ricky Piagiola, drum player. Jimmy Ash in better, vocals and lead guitar. Rob Mitchell, bass guitar and vocals. Oh, okay. Well, thanks again, guys, for coming today. Um, uh, tell us a little bit about how you all got started uh, wanting to be an art artist. You know, everybody has their story, and you can talk to us uh, one at a time if you'd like. Paul, uh, like everybody, like everybody else, as a, as a youngster, that interest in music grabs some people more than others. Mm -hmm. uh, we're all kind of were, even though we didn't grow up together, we're of the same mind to where that interest in music starts from hearing it on the television and the radio, of course, and uh, mm -hmm. the inclination to actually try and play follows. And the aptitude to do that, some people have it, some people don't. Uh, some stick with it, and it becomes it, it becomes a hobby and then a passion to play. Uh, and some don't. Some get other outside interests, and uh, music takes a back seat. But uh, we all got started the same way uh, as uh, I guess you would say grade school, middle school, and uh, the, that interest. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> carries on, carries on even today. So we got started, and we've been carrying on ever since. And uh, I'm going to. Uh, my wife Lois is here in the back, trying to make me laugh. Trying to make us so, all laugh. <laughs> Am I doing but, good? But uh, <laughs> yeah, the interest is there. It still remains, Paul, and and uh, we are we are blessed to be have found each other over the past oh, a decade or so, and we've been able to perform. And, uh, and we have become friends. Our wives have become friends and are quite involved with all this as well. So uh, uh, as it started, it still remains. Okay. Well, that's a great story. I'm glad you all are, uh, found each other and decided to form a group. And uh, hopefully you'll have a few more years ahead of you. And... Amen to that, brother. <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> uh, what uh, what are what are some of the influences uh, that helped uh, you know influence the style of your band? Uh, maybe you could uh, tell us a little bit about that. Rob influences? I'll let Rob please Rob talk. <laughs> well, you know, I grew up around music, and we always had it in the house, and I we listened to just about everything uh, at home. But uh, being a product of the '60s and '70s, uh, that stuff probably influences me the most you know as far as my playing and all but you know you pull from other things too and uh you know you develop your style through that but primarily 60 70 stuff mm. jimmy okay rob <laughs> anything <laughs> from the british you. invasion to uh 
actually, the original Outsiders, their first big hit was Time Won't Let Me. Hmm. That's the band he was in. Hmm. And um, that was like the first or, uh, that was the first or second uh, song I actually learned on the, on the guitar. So it's kind of cool to be able to come full circle. Um, anywhere from the Beatles to Cat Stevens, you know, the Moody Blues, just uh, just a, a student of the music. And that seems to work very well for us. Okay. Well, yeah, those are some great bands, you know, and uh, I don't know a person that hasn't been influenced by the Beatles, you know, and... Uh, and who? Uh, Rick hasn't. Who? Rick's never even heard of them. The who? <laughs> uh, Not the who. Long uh, band. Who? Whatever. <laughs> yeah, even uh, Cat Stevens, you know, he was obviously a legend, and... Um, oh, yeah. Uh, some people might be watching this uh, interview right now, and they may want to say to themselves, how am I going to get your music? I'm sure it's on all streaming platforms, but they may want to follow you on social media as well. Uh, tell everybody the details on that. Oh, that's hilarious. Um, James. Our website is www.theoutsidersusalive.com, or they can go to theoutsiders.rocks. That should take them there, too, as well. We're also Rock. on Facebook. Rock without the S. Rock, rock without the S. Rock without the S. The yeah, outsiders yeah. rock without the S, I'm told. Because I always listen to what Mr. Storm says. Um, and we're on Facebook. Uh, okay, thanks to our friends at Big Records for all the uh, opportunities we've had through them. And um, you know, we can hardly wait to get out there and start playing live and yeah, start kicking it, man. You know, show them what we can do. Okay. Uh, well, what what about streaming sites? I guess it's an on all streaming platforms. You can find, yeah, yeah. You can a, find it on almost every streaming site that exists, and some that yeah. don't exist. Just uh, Spotify, so iTunes, space, yeah. iTunes, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not on MySpace though. Oh. It's a little old. <laughs> I'm I'm told. Yeah. So, you know. Okay, well, everybody go to those streaming uh, sites and all those websites he told you about and check them out. Uh, they would be glad that you did that and. Um, we're going to check uh, out your song in just a minute. It's called uh, I've Got a Heart Too. And... Yes, sir. It's our, it's our new single. Oh, okay. And it's a very good song. Is there a story behind that song? Maybe you want to share that with us. Uh, I I came in with the skeleton and, and the gentleman of the orchestra and I, you know, we kind of came up with the parts and made it happen. And, Paul, it was recorded live. Uh, All four of us in the room at the same time. We hadn't died yet. Yeah, we hadn't died yet. So um, all four of us in the room, knocking it out, and that's what you hear. Mm. A couple overdubs for acoustic guitar, you know, for radio. But besides that, what you see is what you get. That's it. That's how it sounds. That's how it sounds when we perform live. <laughs> Trying to keep that in mind when we do play out Absolutely. in front of people that we, re we reproduce the records the same way that we play live. So there's there's very little added, very little extra effects. Uh, that's pretty much, like you said, what you see is what you get. That's what you, what you hear is what, is what we provide. Okay. Well, it, it, it is a great song, and I know everyone's dying to get into it. We'll get into that in one second. But uh, before we do that, uh, guys, thank you so much for coming on the show today. We're glad to have you here. And uh, come back anytime you want to plug something new. We'll have you back on. <laughs> thank you so much Thanks, paul we appreciate thank you. it thank you thank you everyone happy summer oh, okay and here it is uh, i've got a heart too by the outsiders and it starts right now Crawl back to you Saw your picture the other day Ain't it funny how things changed When you look in the other way And I've got a heart too And I don't know what you're trying to prove And it breaks 
And I've got a 